Hey, good morning to you. How are you doing today? Or good evening, good day, however, whenever you catch this for you. Hope you're doing well. This is David here with you, where we talk about balancing the triad, body, mind, spirit. It's the way you work on those three elements, and in turn, you improve your health, wellness, and fitness. And specifically, do it in ways that work for you and fit into your life. <clears throat> so today's topic is one I've covered before, more than once, and I'm probably I'll be covering it more than once again. But it's your thoughts versus your actions. <clears throat> we do need to think. We need to think about things, what we're going to do, what do we want, how we're going to go about it. So in regards to health, we can say, okay, we want to trim up. We don't like the excess flab hanging around our waist, our legs. So it's like, okay, we want a different body. We want to look at that. You can take some time to picture it, visualize it, know what you want to look like, what's going to be like in three, six, 12 months. <clears throat> What the, then you can say, okay, what do we want to do? How do we want to go? Okay, we're going to start working on our nutrition. We're going to start doing some exercises, do some weight retraining. And you start planning these things out. Okay, what obstacles may come up? We can go through there and do that. But a lot of people only do that. All they do is they sit there and just keep thinking about it. They ponder, so okay, this is something I need to work on. i probably be in my best interest if I worked on this. I could probably do that. Um, yeah, I can do that there, but that's as far as they go. They don't go any farther, and they just keep thinking, just keep thinking. And it's not, <clears throat> we have to, I have talked about before, analysis process. We keep analyzing over, over and over something, making sure it's right, making sure it's right. Are we doing this right? Are we doing right? This isn't even that, this isn't going that far. This is just like, yeah, I could be doing this. Yeah, I probably could, that would probably help me out by doing that. And I could probably drink some more water. I could probably take some quiet time. Yeah, I can probably fit in about 10 minutes a day of at least walking. Yeah, I could spend some time outside, but that's all it is. It's constantly the thought process. All it is, they're just thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about it, but no doing. And that's basically going to get you nowhere. Most of us haven't figured out how to, uh, can't even learn time, but basically <clears throat> teleport ourselves from one place to another. There's astral projection, but we're talking completely physically doing this. Most people haven't figured out how to, most people I know haven't figured out how to do that. But in the meantime, so we're going to have to actually get up and do do something. If you're thinking about going across town, yeah, I can go this. Okay, what route would I take? Um, yeah, okay, I can do that there. I can drive this way. I can go in the car. I can go that way. I can go this way. What traffic's going to be like? But unless you actually get in your vehicle and go, you ain't going to get there. <clears throat> Same thing with your health and wellness. You can ponder and think about things. Now, granted, there are times where, yes, sitting there quietly and pondering things is absolutely beneficial. <clears throat> and works into your health and wellness. Um, even sitting there pondering, you can you can ponder on a question. It can be some form of meditation. You can sit outside and let your mind wander and daydream. But I've been using that word even but later. You got to take action on those. Especially works. I mean, I'm gonna, okay. Now I'm, I'm was going to go somewhere, but that's a whole nother topic. I'll do that another time. But it's just making sure to take those actions, and that's why I'm always big on those baby steps micro steps what can you what's a small step you can do to at least get yourself going to do something you got an idea you spent some time you thought about it, so what's the smallest action you can take right now to at least make a step in that direction even in um the training i always keep sharing about in my uh the free training i have in my facebook group is uh health and wellness your way and what it, and one of the steps in there is we break things down through, we talk about your long-term goals. And then another, the next step is breaking your short-term goals. And we break it down into micro goals, which is, in a sense, the baby steps. Or even smaller than that. You want to do half baby steps. How's that? But the idea I want you to come across here today is just making sure that, think about it. Yes, think, do it. and But make sure you actually take the action on it. Otherwise, you're not going to get anywhere. You can be here six months from now and, Still be thinking about the same thing. Still be thinking, yeah, I could lose some weight. I'm a little chubby. My blood pressure's still up. And yet you've done nothing to improve it. Thoughts help out tremendously, but unless you actually take action on them, pretty much going to be in the same spot that you were. Now, granted, I, <clears throat> there are research studies. This is tangent here. Uh, research studies that if you go through and visualize yourself exercising, you will actually in strengthen, increase the muscles as well. So there is some, you'll get not as much as though if you actually exercised. 
and they're all so I guess there's a difference between that and your visualization. If you visualize, you're actually going there, you're visualizing yourself lifting, say, that bar for curls, that actually knows changes increase in size, increase in strength. And you can visualize yourself doing a technique perfectly, enhances that technique. But it's still going out and doing the thing, all right? So slight tangent. But yeah, don't just think, make sure you do as well. All right, so make sure you got that going on. See what you can do for yourself today. What action can you take today to prove yourself and get yourself going? So. Need any help in that? If you want uh, that um, guide I was talking about in the description, there's a link to that in the there's a link to that Facebook group where you can get it, along with some other little trains in there. But that's what I got for you. So go ahead, enjoy the rest of your day. We'll catch you tomorrow. So take care and balancing to you. Bye bye.